Martin Wonder, someone that everyone respects uh, professionally, you know, every single pro player in Europe respects him. Wonder trying to do what he can, no oh. flashes, Baxi jumps oh, in, he does. misses again, the building and the minions are there, Baxi, you're gonna burn down, my friend! They know how good he is mechanically, they know how solid he is, he's a top lane Viking, you know, um, he's extremely ruthless in the top lane, he has mechanics, he, he understands team play, he knows how to communicate, he's the perfect teammate, and from day one, we were actually, you know, always extremely interested in working with Wonder at some point in time. So I'm so happy to say that uh, we at G2 are going to do our best efforts to make Wonder uh, known across the globe uh, for the right reasons. And we're going to help him build his brand. And more importantly, he's going to help us win a few more titles. Wonder, for the next two years, at the very least, you're going to be with us and we're more than happy to have you. Jankos, the first Blood King. Who doesn't like Jankos? One more kick. Wardhop goes in. Jankos, the first Blood King. Extremely aggressive, super fun to watch, fan favorite. Um, you know, when you're a teammate of Jankos, you know that that guy will work his ass off. You know, to make magic work. You know, his ambition is, you know beyond anything you've seen and you know that his aggression in game is going to help you get ahead in lane. He's a great teammate to have and from a branding perspective, who doesn't want to have the Polish army with you? Jean-Pierre Dole! Having Jankos for the next two years at the very least makes us very happy and I'm more than happy myself to mentor him as much as I can and help him improve as a player, as a person, as a businessman. Peter, or how he likes to be called, Petter, is specimen number one of the upgrade, the famous upgrade of G2. Try to say something about that as he hops in. It looks like the fight's already been turned. They look for Mythic. Oh, Spade! Spade. They knock Spade in! And can they take him down? Yarden says, yes, we can. Perks around the side, a triple kill, just like that for the Callista. And it's gonna it. be the Quadra! I'm gonna tell you something. Peter Yarnan will be the most known and most successful Sweet on the Rift, that I promise you. We are looking already for the IKEA Meatball sponsorship. So IKEA, if you're watching, we're here waiting. We have the best suite on the Rift. With that said, do you know that Jarnan can build a Billy bookcase in a fraction of time that Jankos the Untilted can? You had no idea about that, right? Neither did I. Jarnan has three year agreement with us, so he's gonna be with us for at the very least three years. I promise you, by the end of 2018, you're gonna know who Yarnan is. Because it might just be double edge stand aside. There's a shockwave. It's not gonna go with it. Oh, it the stamens are melting. Yarnan is massive. What did show in those mechanics? And they don't show any sign of stopping. Mr. Vane, I gotta say, his name is pretty cool. Really, really cool. What if specimen number two from the very famous upgrade from G2? He's incredibly good mechanically. We could see last year uh, with Rocket, himself and Yarnan did a fantastic job despite potentially not being surrounded by you know, the best team and environment, who knows. He was always very solid and very good. Known for the Wadab and for his extremely entertaining streams, Wadid has a three-year agreement with us, same as his teammate, Yarnan, and it is our intention our willingness and pretty much what's going to happen that he becomes one of the best if not the best supports on the planet he has the willingness to learn and he has all the energy in the world to show the world that he's not just a random korean but a true korean mid lane here comes a play on a baker exhaust and zon keeps oh. away from the wall not quick enough to get slow there's a flash to chase first blood into perks oh my goodness luka perkovic from croatia perks Probably more known in the scene as Michael Schofield, Radnar Lodbrok, or Tanin Tatum. Especially for the ladies. He is incredibly, incredibly committed to victory. You guys don't understand. Like just working with him is a pleasure, you know? Of course you go through ups and downs. As you guys know, we've gone through, you know, MSIs that have gone south, worlds that have gone south, uh, and pretty much bad tournaments, you know? But the amount of stuff this guy has learned and how fast he has learned it 
is unbelievable. The amount of talks I've gotten with him throughout these years uh, to help him understand uh, some things that you know he actually took no time in understanding pretty much um, is unbelievable. He's incredibly mature, he's an adult and right now he has a huge task in front of him which is he's pretty much seen as the captain of the team and now you know for a young guy like him to become the captain of a team that is expected to have so great results is an incredible burden you know on his shoulders. He's gonna make him grow uh, is gonna increase his value as a person and as a player. And I'm more than happy to let you guys know that he'll be with us for at the very least three more years. Luca has G2 in his heart, and you know, we, I myself personally, have Luca in my heart. He reminds me of myself when I was a player. I think he's an improved version of what I was as a player, and I'm more than happy to mentor him in the years moving forward. I think he's accomplished quite a bit ever since, in, since he's in G2. I think it's two years and a half already. And I can't begin to imagine the amount of success he'll find when he's for five years and a half with us. So nothing of this would have happened without his help. I appreciate that. We love him very much. And we surely hope we're gonna kick some ass together. We're extremely proud of having a winning lineup after being two years undefeated in Europe. It's, as you can imagine, really challenging to keep all our players in the offseason. It was really challenging, as you can imagine, but we're really proud of having the team that we have. And more importantly, we're extremely proud of uh, having long-term agreements with them, which, believe it or not, is really not that common, uh, neither in North America nor in Europe. So I'm looking forward to the next season. We're looking forward to the next season. Thank you very much to the G2 Army. Thank you very much. To all of you samurai out there cheering for us, you guys are the best, and I'm out of here. Oh, that's not a bad jersey. Oh, this feels good. Pretty, I like that. You know what else I like? I like this guy. If you want to become a samurai just like I am, Subscribe, just like I did.